waste no more time arguing what a good man should be. Be one. You could live life right now, let that determine what you do, say, and think. If it's not right, do not do it. If it's not true, do not say it. Stop drifting, sprint to the finish, write off your hopes, and if your well-being matters to you, be your own savior while you can. Let us prepare our minds as if we would come to the very end of life. Let us postpone nothing. Let us balance life's book each day. The one who puts the finishing touch on their life each day is never short of time. The happiness of your life depends upon the quality of your thoughts. You have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this and you will find strength. He who fears death will never do anything worthy of a man who is alive. Life is very short and anxious for those who forget the past, neglect the present and fear the future. Hang on to your youthful enthusiasm. You will be able to use them better when you're older. Begin at once to live and count each separate days as a separate life. Whatever can happen at any time can happen today. They lose the day in expectation of the night and the night in fears of the down. True happiness is to enjoy the present without anxious dependence upon the future, not to amuse ourselves with either hopes or fears, but to rest satisfied with what we have, which is so efficient for he that is so wants nothing. The greatest blessing of mankind are within us and within our reach. A wise man is content with his lot, whatever it might be, without wishing for what he has not. Luck is what happens when preparation meets opportunity. How long are you going to wait before you demand the best for yourself? Do not explain your philosophy. Embody it. Will consists not in having great position, but in having a few wants. The key is to keep company only with people who uplift you, whose present calls for your best. If you want to improve, be content to be taught foolish and stupid. <laughs>